Let's look at the registry viewer in the OS Forensics Toolkit. OS Forensics includes a built-in registry viewer to display the contents of registry hive files and has options to copy value names, data, and to export registry keys and their subkeys to a text file. Clicking the registry viewer icon on the start tab of OS Forensics will open a dialog that will allow you to pick a registry file to open. When a drive is selected, the known locations of registry files as well as the root directory are scanned. Any registry files found will be displayed. If you have a collection of registry files in another location, you can use the Browse button to navigate to their, to their location and open them. When a Windows system disk or image file is selected, the registry hives will be presented to you automatically without having to designate their full path or their file pass as shown here in this example. The SAM hive is very important and stores many valuable data pertaining to Windows user accounts such as logins, install date and time, and much more. It also is the location where Windows stores user password hashes, password hints, and other relevant data. Data is presented in hex view as shown here. If you would like to view the data in ASCII, simply right click and choose the Show Binary Data in ASCII option. Here is what the same view looks like after converting to ASCII. One of the primarily relevant artifacts stored in the system hive is USB records. One of the several locations this information is stored is located in the following path in the system hive. System, Control Set 001, Enum, and USB Store. Other areas such as USB, SCSI, and more will contain potentially relevant details as well. Each Windows user account gets an ntuser.dat registry hive. These are some of the few user specific registry hives on a system. In this example, we see the search history records for the peer to peer application ARIES displayed in hexadecimal format. ntuser.dat hives are located at the root of each user account. You can use OS Forensics Registry Viewer independently from a case, such as if you had a set of registry hives provided to you to examine. Instead of choosing a selected device or drive from a case, you could simply open OS Forensics, open the Registry Viewer module, and click the Browse button. Next, you would click on the Other Devices Available link as shown here in this slide. Next, point the registry viewer to a registry hive in the next step. OSF's registry viewer will then open the hive without having to create a case or bring in the hive to your case through the Add Device module. To add registry artifacts to your case, simply highlight the data, right click and choose Add to Case. Another nice feature to mention is the automated reports that you can generate within the Registry Viewer module. Simply click on the Export Report button as shown here in this slide, then name the report after the particular hive. In this case, we are going to create an automated report of the SAM hive. Note that this is not currently available, however, for the security hive. Here we see a sample SAM Hive HTML report that you can generate automatically which will give you relevant details on the Windows user accounts. 